Y'all, I'm 46 years old. What the hell happened? How did I suddenly turn 46? I am a September baby. I just turned 46 on the 8th. And I feel uh, so many emotions. Glad to be here. Um, I've really picked up a lot of knowledge, particularly over the last 10 years. And I'm feeling good about 46. Although I do have to get glasses. They're currently being ordered right now. Um, my eyesight has gone down the shitter. Um, however, I wanted to talk, uh, we're not gonna talk about that on this video. We're gonna talk about exercise for the month of September and what I have been doing and my thoughts kind of around um, reintegrating exercise on a serious basis. If you guys have followed along for any amount of time on this channel, and if you're new here, hi, my name is Anna McKenna. I really have been struggling to not only break a plateau, but also with getting serious about exercise. And I think a lot of that has to do with the fact that I still have a side effect of feeling very fatigued. But I also noticed recently that I am struggling with some hip pain in my left hip that I'm finding a little bit concerning. And I've noticed now that I'm 46, that my mobility has really um, kind of gone downhill. I'm not able to stretch as much and feel like my joints are as loose as they've been in the past. I'm feeling a lot more, here's my friend, hi. Um, I'm feeling a lot tighter and so, this month that I turned 46, I was like, okay, girl, you need to get serious and figure out how you're going to start implementing more regular movement into your day to day. Um, and so I looked into something called somatic movement. We did a um, interview with my friend um, Elena, who did uh, talked about the benefits of somatic dance. But as I was doing my research and figuring out like, how can I get some more regular movement into my day to day? Um, my, on my Instagram, I noticed that um, somatic exercise was surfacing more and more, you know, the algorithm knows. And I was curious because they talk a lot about releasing your hips. And because that's where I'm feeling a lot of pain lately, I thought that that might be a good place to start. And so um, I purchased a course. I'm not gonna, this is not like an ad or any sort of sponsorship. Um, this video is not sponsored or anything, but I will tell you about it and you can do your own research and figure it out. Um, I chose to purchase a free your hips course from the Workout Witch on Instagram. And it basically is a 30 day um, program that you go through um, and she teaches you and shows you how to do all these different exercises in order to free um, your hips. It talks a lot about stored trauma. It talks a lot about all the ins and outs of what might be going on in here that is manifesting out there. So I liked that component of it as well. But mostly what caught my attention was my friggin' hip hurts. And so like maybe this would be a good way to kind of free that locked up left hip of mine and see if I can start feeling a little bit more movement overall in my joints so that I can go back to a more strenuous exercise routine. I like to lift heavy weights. I like to be on the treadmill, you know, doing incline walking um, and doing a bunch of different things. And because I've been so tired on this medication, I haven't really had the stamina to do that on a very regular basis. So I looked into this, I'm like, you know what? Let's check it out, let's see what's going on. So long story short, I started this 30 day program. The movement is not huge. In fact, it feels a little weird because you're like, am I working out or, or like what's happening? Um, but I have to say, I'm probably on like day 10 of it right now. And I've been alternating my days with just simply walking on the treadmill and hopes to move my body a little bit more. And I will say that I do feel like I am becoming a little bit more mobile in my hips and joint area. 
the, the exercises are very small exercises, um, but I have noticed that I'm a little bit more limber, a little bit, I'm able to stretch a little bit more, and I do feel like perhaps some of my joints are starting to unlock a little bit, particularly in my hip rotation turnout, um, and I'm feeling a little bit less pain because I was getting worried because if I if I was sitting with like cross legs, crisscross applesauce, I was feeling pain in my left hip and I'm like, what the hell? I mean, I know I'm 46 now, but like, what is going on? And so, um, you know, this just started to be something that I became interested in, something that I thought would be good. I've been doing it on my PEMF mat, which I'm going to do a whole video about that. Um, that might be a little woo for some of you, but I do think it's beneficial and basically it's a heated mat. And so I have really enjoyed going through this process and I do think it is helping me. So all that to say, if you are looking for a way to start incorporating a little bit more regular exercise in your day to day as you go through um titrating up on your medication, this might be an option for you. You guys know I'm just here to share with you what I'm doing and see if it's something that you might be interested in as well. You don't have to use the workout witch. There's a lot of different um, somatic healers or exercises, somatic hip movements. I mean, literally, if you type it into Google or pull it up on Instagram, you will probably get dealt a whole bunch of options. But I like the component of it being an overall health and wellness experience and not just so much like, let's get in the gym and let's do it. Let's do it so hard. I, for me right now, I'm trying to be really gentle with my body. I'm really trying to do some work on the nervous system, you guys. I'm really trying to bring down my cortisol levels. I'm really trying to like be kinder to myself, treat myself and my body a little bit better, go a little bit easier. I've seen some people transform who have taken this approach. They look totally different. They are and act totally different because they are going a little bit easier on themselves. That's tough for me to do. I mean, I'm military. I've been like going hard on myself for like 25 years at this point. But I think it's important for us to like take stock of where we're at I've done that right about now with my um, 46th birthday that just happened. Um, and I think that that is the approach that I am that I am doing for myself right now. And I'm sharing it with y'all. Um, real quick before I get off, I want to share with you, I'm doing a free boot camp. In the, in the thread of treating ourselves well, I'm doing a free boot camp on October 16th, 2 p.m. Eastern time. Yes, it will be recorded, but I hope you can show up live. We're gonna be talking about like where you're at with your health and wellness, where you're at with your mindset, where you're at with your finances, where you're at with your home, kind of taking stock of where we're at, identifying gaps and figuring out quick things that you can do to really um, get some quick wins and improve areas of your life to include your weight loss, to include your wellness, to include what's going on with your mental health, a whole bunch of things. So I'm going to be putting out more information about that soon, but it's totally free. I hope you'll join me. Um, we're going to have a registration link. I'm going to put it up in the community tab. So keep an eye on that soon. And I will be doing another video about that. But you guys know that this is my passion and that I really want to help people in our community just live their very best version of themselves. I want people to go easy on themselves. I don't want everything to be so hard all the time. I want people to lose this weight and get into a healthy environment so that they don't end up there, back there again, struggling, miserable, unhappy. It's so many things involved. There's so much momentum involved in how we do this. And it's it's work that I've been doing with service members for like 15 years at this point. And I want to share it with more people. Um, every time I think to myself, like, nobody's going to want this. I have someone saying like, what you're doing helped me. And I think it can help a lot of people. So that's why I'm doing this. Um, and so I hope that you will join us for that. It's going to be on Zoom. It's going to be interactive. I'm going to be answering questions. 
and um, it's going to be awesome. So I hope that you'll join us. Check out somatic exercise, somatic movement, free your hips, like Google all those things and let me know what you think about it. Talk to you soon.